I was 17. Um, I was probably like every other young young bloke cancer. I was absolutely invincible. I was absolutely convinced that nothing could touch me, nothing could come near me. I was actually um, up on holiday with the mates, playing beach cricket one day, and uh, one of my mates says to me, mate, what, what's that lump in your chest? And I sort of thought it was there, but you know, it did not even cross my mind that there could be something serious. You know, I'd, cancer wouldn't have even, wouldn't have even been on the horizon. It was something that so, to me at the time, was so obscure. When I got back, it was sort of, it wasn't hurting or anything, but it was just itchy, just sort of itchy, and I thought, oh, probably get this checked out so went to the GP and he, he sort of looked at it and that and and it was when I'm having the ultrasound and you just they've got the the, the wand or whatever it is and it's just oh shit and they walk out that's when I'd, I sort of I'd, I actually don't think I accepted it at the time I think I noticed at the time but I, I sort of just blocked it out I, and dad particularly noticed it because dad was sitting in there with me it was that moment that we sort of said mm, they're not gonna be reacting like that if this is just nothing. And as it turns out, it was an eight by 15 centimetre tumour in my chest. You know, they described it as the size of a grapefruit. 